The purpose of today's video is to discuss about how we can export a device loss file from PowerForge design to PSIM. So here we are starting from a design which has been generated by PowerForge. We are talking about a non-isolated DC-DC converter and uh, 6 kilowatts. And in terms of switches, we are dealing here with six switches in series. The switch which has been selected is a MOSFET, 600 volt, 60 amp. So how do we do this? We go on the menu, on the top menu, we click on export PSIM files. Straight away we get the, the message that we can register on the, the hard disk, on the desktop. Okay, this is what we do. Since this is a zip file, we want to unzip it. Okay, and here we are, we have a folder. Now, what do we do? We do in, we go in PSIM. In, we click on utilities and we go on the device database editor. All right. Now we want to add the features of the components we have uh, got from the previous design. So what we do is we go on device, import device from XML file and we select the file which has been generated. Since we are dealing with the MOSFET, we'll leave it in the, this, this uh, library. And here we are. We have the device loss file which has been registered and we have the new component also which has been added to the library of PC. So this is very convenient. Again, PowerForge will give you the design. If you want to take your design further and go to the simulation tool, this is what we, you can do and, and uh, work further on your workflow. Thank you for watching the video. So we showed you how to perform the export from PowerForge to PSIM. If you want to know more, visit our website powerdesign.tech. You can also follow us on Twitter, LinkedIn and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.